You're watching News 10 ABC at 9 a.m. Welcome back, everyone. It's 923 on your Monday morning. From finding those diapers to nailing down child care to keep your job, one Capital Region woman gets it. There are so many challenges that come with motherhood. Kyla Schmidt is kicking off our Mom Boss series this week, and she's helping moms succeed in every single area with her organization, Mom Starts Here. Thanks for joining us, Kyla. Thanks for having me, Stephanie. So let's start off for people at home. What is Mom Starts Here? Yeah, so Mom Starts Here is a nonprofit organization, and our mission is to support parents in their internal and their external needs so that they can thrive. Why did you start, decide to start this about seven years ago? Yeah, so when I was 19, about 11-ish years ago, I had an unplanned pregnancy and struggled to find community resources to help myself and my son. Um, and about four years after he was born, I founded the organization to start filling some of those gaps that I experienced. What did you think was the hardest part of that experience for you? I realized how much internal work it takes to be a present parent mm -hmm. um, and the emotional support that's needed. And aside from the material support, there really wasn't a whole lot that was addressing both in our community. As a young mom that had a toddler at the time, how did you end up building up this huge nonprofit organization? Little by little, honestly, you know, I did it as a volunteer for the first four years. And wow. when COVID hit, um, I was able to go full time and the need also was great at that time as well. Tell us about what COVID has done to moms, especially in the workforce, Kyla. Yeah, moms that are already isolated and under-resourced, it's been very challenging to find support in their communities and to help raise their children. And so COVID really amplified that. Mm. Um, and part of what was happening was folks weren't able to get out to access resources or work. And a lot of the childcare options were really limited for folks and they still are. What are you seeing at this time is the biggest concern for moms still? Yeah, I think it's just a matter of having that community and having the village. And that's really what Mom Starts mm. Here aims to do is to be the village for folks that don't have that. And even like going through your pictures today as I was prepping for this interview, you can see that there's just a sense of community, a sense of togetherness for these moms. Why is that important? It's so important because the work that it takes to parent is a daily kind right. of work, right? And so to have people that are in your corner, it makes all the difference. Um, so that's why we do peer groups and community support and even try and have, you know, virtual support through our mobile app as well. Tell us about some of the programs you offer, because I know some of it is tangible stuff, like if you need diapers, if you need formula, but also there's also mental health prep and things that you're doing to help them just get by day by day. Yeah, exactly. So we have two master certified life coaches on our staff, and mm -hmm. so we approach that side from a life coaching perspective, but we also have two community care maternal health workers in Schenectady that work with prenatal patients throughout their pregnancy. So that's sort of the way that we support the internal needs, along with creating and providing parenting content. You've been doing this for seven years. What's a story of a mom that sticks out in your mind that really just has stuck with you and shows how important this work is? Yeah, there are so many, but honestly, it's the ones where we have that opportunity. You know, we've had moms that we've had the opportunity to walk with them for years mm -hmm. and to see their development, to see them get the job and access transportation and childcare and grow and really see them show up for their children in a way that they feel proud of um, and helping them get resourced with diapers and baby items over the years. It's such an incredible privilege to have the ability to do that. How many moms do you think you've helped so far? That's a tough question. I know that we served over 700 individual families last year. Um, so I would say definitely in the thousands at this point, um, moms and, and then children would be another couple thousand, yeah. If anyone at home wants to help, it's very easy to remember this, momstartshere.com. Thank you so much for Dot coming org. here to get yes. pilot. Thank Dot you. org, excuse me, momstartshere.org. <laughs> Appreciate you kicking Thanks, off Stephanie. our Mom Boss series. You are definitely a Mom Boss, Kyla. I appreciate it. Thanks for having me. It's 927 right now. We're going to be right back with another look at that forecast and more news.